Hello and welcome to a, to a game, to me playing a game. That's that's what this is. It's not a really a segment. It's not anything. I'm just previewing the Marvel vs. Capcom Fighting Collection Arcade Classics. You know, funny story. I uh, was at the Level Up Expo here in Las Vegas for 2024 and uh, bought Marvel vs. Capcom 2 because I remember playing it and as a kid or teenager, whatever, and enjoying it and wishing I owned the game and could never find a copy of the game. And the because it was so hard to get Marvel vs. Capcom 2, the price for it went up very much. You can look up to kind of see where the price, I think it's gone down since this game's come out. But after I spent a lot of money purchasing that game, two weeks later, it is now announced that this was coming out. I was disappointed and my day was ruined, but I was brought back up because I was like, oh cool, there's other games on here too. Uh, that I am very happy at Fighter Awards. About player stats. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm getting distracted. But I'm, I'm very happy because there are a lot of different games on here. X-Men Children of Adam. This is another game that's like a really high priced. Marvel Super Heroes. Same. Like every single one of these. X-Men vs. Street Fighter. Marvel Super Heroes vs. Street Fighter. Marvel vs. Capcom. The first. Clash of Heroes. Marvel vs. Capcom 2 and the Punisher game that I remember playing on the Sega Genesis. All six of these, seven of these, seven uh, of these games were just ridiculously priced uh, to damn near being a hundred or at least over a hundred dollars. And uh, I'm glad that now I don't have to pay that much to get these games anymore because I really wanted to get this one. There was a, a time when my local GameStop had it on the shelf, pre-owned, and I had the money to buy it. And I saw it on the shelf because I used to work there. And when I got home the next day, I was like, hey, can somebody take me up to go get this game? Because I really want to purchase this game. It's very hard to get, very hard to find. And we need to get up there now. We need to go get it. And uh, I was told we'll go tomorrow. Not feeling too good. So that's what we did. And of course, when we went up there, it was gone. And that sucked because after that day, never again did I see Marvel vs. Capcom in the wild at a GameStop. You would see it at uh, your kind of like local game stores, retro game stores being like over a hundred bucks and things like that. But to find it at a GameStop meant, oh, this is going to be decently priced and uh, won't be over a hundred bucks. So now that I finally own it, I own it for the PlayStation 2 also. And I was watching another YouTuber <laughs> called Maximilian Dude, who's very big into fighting games. And they actually did a Marvel vs. Capcom to Infinity and Beyond mod for the Marvel vs. Capcom Infinity game and he was showcasing that and he was talking about Marvel vs. Capcom 2 and said that the PlayStation 2 version is the worst version of Marvel vs. Capcom 2 that made me feel really great because that's what I bought was the PlayStation 2 version so I was like cool that's cool I got, I got the worst version of it awesome it was also available on Dreamcast, which apparently is the best version, and Xbox, which is in the middle, and nobody talks about the middle game. Just the best and worst. So I, I probably should have aimed for Xbox, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, it's uh, it's good, great. I played the Punisher when I was younger on the Sega game, or Sega Genesis. I want to say it was during Sega Channel. I don't believe I owned the game, but it was on there and it's a beat em up side scroller type game like Streets of Rage. And you play as the Punisher. And if player two comes in, he plays as Nick Fury. I want to say you actually had a choice between picking the Punisher or Nick Fury, but you would also fight against villains like the Marauders, which are X-Men villains. 
And so that kind of threw me off when I saw them come on and go, I don't remember the Marauders being a Punisher villain. Well, this was the 90s and it, that could have very well happened. But at the end, you fight Kingpin, which is a Punisher villain. And then uh, X-Men Children of Adam, which is just an X-Men fighting game. I never played it. I don't think so, because a lot of these were just arcade cabinets found in different places, roller rinks and wherever else they had arcades. Marvel superheroes, same, never really played it. That's when they started introducing Captain America, the Hulk, I think Iron Man's in this. <clears throat> and then the X-Men versus Street Fighter is what started the whole Marvel versus Capcom franchise where it's just X-Men characters, just Street Fighter characters going at it. And then Marvel superheroes versus Street Fighters. So getting more of a variety on the Marvel side with Street Fighters still just being Street Fighters. And then that's when they finally got the, the idea and this is where the game just took off from here. And then plateaued around three and then it was just all downhill after three. <laughs> I wasn't a big fan of Infinity, but when Infinity came out, and I had to get the collector's edition for it because I saw those Infinity Stones in there and I was like, oh, I'm, I'm gonna get the Infinity Stones with this. This is gonna be great. And then just to find out that they're just plastics attached inside of a plastic box that glow and they don't look like stones as much as they do like eggs. So I've got the infinity eggs inside of a plastic box that they don't come out of. And now that's that's great. I'm so glad I own this. Yes. <laughs> uh, but I haven't tried the uh, infinity in beyond mod because I, I don't think I have Marvel vs. Capcom Infinity on Steam. Mm. So, without further ado, it might nice story time. We don't need to drag on with that. Let's play a game. Let's... God, I kind of want to do the Punisher first. So we're going to do that. Uh, I'm going to select that. Not a fighting game. It's the one game in here that's not a fighting game. Cap's got the top. Capcom. Capcom. Capcom CP says team. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Based upon characters appearing in magazines. New York, a jungle of steel and concrete, where predators of all kinds mercilessly prey on all. Central Park, an oasis of green offering respite from the gray. Here, U.S. Marine Captain Frank Castle enjoys. On that day, the Castle family accidentally discovered a brutal mob killing, fearing the witness the killers gunned down the family. On that day, Frank Castle's family died. On that day, Frank Castle died. On that day, I was born. To avenge them and all others, I am the Punisher. If you're guilty, you're dead. 1993 is when this game came out. And the Punisher was always just like such a great little, great character. Playing this when I was like four or five. And you know, I turned out just just fine. <laughs> We're gonna play as the Punisher. What was that? <sighs> Definitely reminds me of an old Street Fighter game. Let's toss, punch, it's a kick. Oh, it looks like if I do certain moves, it damages me. We can pick up the bags of money. Break that. Let's continue. Uh, there's pizza. Calabunga, dude. That old Punisher catchphrase, y'all remember that? The Punisher? You can run, but you can't hide. I've got a plan. Oh. Oh, wow. All right. Oil drop. Oh, that's just like a fast forward. Trying to see what the shoulder buttons did. Oh, oh, 
Oh, I can press B and I get a grenade. Get out of here. We got six uses on a knife. I don't even think we're holding that. It's like just between our fingers, hanging off of this side there. It almost looks like he got stabbed through our hand. You're finished now, Bruno. Scully, get him. Scully, you better leave before you get punished. Lost my knife. What well, he said, right? He would tell people, I'm gonna. I'm gonna punish you. Well, Scully does a lot of damage. <clears throat> Ooh, and for not having a damn block button. Uh, I guess the grenades are my life. I'm over here pressing B, thinking I can throw them. You guys have medieval axes and, and <laughs> swords? What is that? Is that a hammer? Did you just bring in a medieval war? Did you guys rob a museum? Get out of here, Scully. These items belong in a museum. Hey, you got achievement. If you want peace, prepare for war. We played the Punisher as the Punisher. <laughs> Tell me where your boss is. Please don't kill me. He's at Castle Petbert, Florida. The place he's going is called Castle, and I'm Frank Castle. Thanks, and goodbye. You've been punished. The only way to get into the castle would be via the drain pipe of the swimming pool. Bruno won't escape me this time. So that explains where they got all the weapons. They, they, they own a castle. This must have just been display pieces. Oh no, I'm trying to drink. I can't turn. I've only got one hand. <laughs> Get out of here. I've got a ring. Who wants to marry me? I'll propose punishment. Oh. Who is that? <clears throat> just I like these ladies just appear in the smoke. Oh, we got stabbed behind. Bring me back, Doc. Heroes never give up at any game. Use continue for the first time. Oh God, what's she doing? <laughs> it's a frog lady. Consider yourself foliage. I guess that's just part of the gun thing. Help me. Save Barbara from a jail cell in the Punisher. You're welcome, Barbara. I don't know how you got back into that jail cell, but I was there to save you. What do you got, helium? Are you gonna attack me with helium? Oh God, it's a flamethrower. Yeah, so you guys dodged that. Oh, okay, they dodged it. I didn't want you to actually dodge it, though. Ow! It's hammer time. I don't die so easily. Time for justice. I'm Batman and Punisher. What the? Bruno! Gah, gah, gah. I have been programmed by the Kingpin to terminate you. Ow. Ow, okay, I guess I should jump when he does that. I don't know how to dodge that one. Ugh. 
a very jumpy boss. Ninja star, I didn't realize. There's a boomerang. Ow! Time to lay down the pipe. Oh, this game a very different game when I said that. Was that glass shattering from him? Oh no! Bring me back. I had another quarter. I see I've disarmed you. How are these buttons doing for all of you out there? Good? Doing pretty good? Consider yourself starred. Ow. It's time for you to go down under. Get it? Because boomerangs are kind of like linked to Australian somehow. Look at that, we got the bombs. <clears throat> Kingpin, uh, I choked on my coffee. <laughs> There's a major drug deal going down at the harbor tonight. It's a chance for me to blow them out of the water. Let's go blow them out of the water. We've now entered the shooting part of the game. You've just been Barreled rolled. Take this, Gus. Do, do, it's knife to meet you. I guess I'll shoot my shot. Having a blast. Oh, this is what I was hoping to get. Let's go. I like how it's just ow. Yeah, that must have just slightly hurt. Ugh. 
Right back at ya. Oh, pretty boy. That's a Marauder character. Ow. Apparently it can exist without a head. I'm using his body as a weapon. Ow. Jeez. Say jeez. What was that? Did you just wind cutter me? I'm sorry, but I don't dance well. I've got two left feet. I'm supposed to kick her as I said that. dynamic entry this game is still as much fun as I remember it batters up I guess you can call me the Batman I'm going to make you run for home. I wanted that pizza. You could have gone back. Can we go back for the pizza? Die in your own blood, baby. Oh, God, another Marauder. Bone breaker. Ow. Do I have another quarter? There's flan on the floor over there. back to shooting guns I'd like to go back to shooting a gun oh that one got me oh yes fist too There we go. Now I get the guns back. Ooh. Oh. Oh god, the pretty boys are back. Oh, he knows how to reverse. Sorry, but you've been double parked. Diagonally, too. Lucky for you, I still have a quarter. Tanks a lot. You could say that fight was explosive.
Do we pick up pretty boy heads? Was this a shooting gallery? It is a shooting gallery. Boom, perfect score. Destroy 20 oil drums on the bonus stage in the Punisher. Like fish in a barrel. This is the name of the achievement that we just played there. They've got a huge poppy field in a mobile factory. All in one underground cave in Arizona. Let's throw a little wrench in the Kingpin's plans. I almost read that as poopy. Like they had a poopy field. How do I use the bombs? Yeah, give me a gun back, please. There we go. Ah, uh, I wanted to pick everything up. Those are all points you just let me leave. Yeah, sorry. It doesn't look like you have a ticket for this train. Looks like I've just derailed you. Oh, oh, I just dropped the bomb. How did I do that? It says B and I'm thinking, oh, I gotta press B, but then now I'm thinking it's probably like B for bomb. Is someone drying their clothes? on this clearly and like distilling drugs as well is that what this is just a giant distiller on top of a train oh my god there's so many there we go i figured it out i know how to, to drop a bomb now Okay, I don't want to keep dropping them. This is getting out of hand. <laughs> I will convey your doom. That's all I can. Oh, God, he got me. All right, yeah, that wasn't a good one. I get it. I like to slice through crime. Ah. Uh, I'm the Punisher. <laughs> Let me ask you a question. Got you in the air, Gus. Oh, Ninja Star. It's like an oversized Ninja Star. Is that beef on a stick? Alright, we took out Gus. I'm taking this knife with me. That doesn't count towards my grenades. Welcome, Punisher. All aboard the Death Express. Oh, it's Bushwhacker. I do want to say Bushwhacker is indeed a Punisher villain. Transforms his whole arm into a weapon. I will rocket you. Oh. Well, 
The little onomatopoeias there with the kablam. What happened just now? Oh god. <laughs> Oh, another quarter. It all makes sense to me. You just do a Zangief spin. They're all doing Zangief spins. I want to do a Zangief spin. Oh, just pile drive me. Is that scream in the Punisher movies, huh? We were robbed. Or the TV show? Couldn't have given out one of those ones? Oh no, he's gonna throw me off the train. Oof. I don't know how to dodge that. Oh! We're back, baby. I want to say when we played this on the Sega, you didn't have unlimited lives. Like you can start uh, just over again that easily. I think it gave you like five credits. How do I dodge your rocket blasts? The only thing I could think to do is to get close, but even that, he still has a close attack. But I can't, like, jump over him. Ugh. I think this is your stop. I just striked you out. Took down Bushwhacker. I mean, this game originally, because it's an arcade game, just designed to eat quarters. So it's supposed to be difficult. Kingpin's Wrath. The Punisher has caused me enough damage. Find where he's hiding and bring me his head. Someone's here already. I finally found you, Punisher, after breaking through plenty of walls. Now I'll have your head. As the plot in the last cutscene was shown. Well, that guy really did bust through a lot of holes, just like, is the Punisher over here? Perhaps he's through this wall. Sometimes violence is the answer. Free the rats. Everybody was kung fu fighting. My bat attack is fast as lightning. And you should all be a little bit frightened. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> if you know the song, you know the song. That's right, sewer cheese. It's got a different taste and smell. That person's name is Dean. Dean! Sam! Nope, that's Yanli. Uh, Red Lamp? Yanli? How, what is it? How to? He shows you how to do things all the time. 
So they started calling him How To. Oh, wow, cat. Bring me back. I'm a dog person. Oh. <laughs> You could say I'm a bit hot-headed. But also people have said I'm a barrel of laughs. I chop down crime. What's this thing do? <laughs> oh god, it's a bomb! <laughs> there we go. This is the weapon that we want. Uh oh. Oh god, there's a lot of them. Oh no! Ow. Ow, the extendo punches, the extendo grabs. Gato, Mr. Roboto. I don't know if that works. What was that? I got a fire extinguisher? I'll put out your terror. Great reign of terror, that is. Because you reign terror. Cool down. As someone I can who has use of fire extinguisher on a person, I can confirm it does not hurt to fire extinguish somebody. <laughs> but it will annoy them. Nunchucks? Oh. Oh. Slice through crime. I may have used that one already. I want your nunchucks. Give me those nunchucks. Give me them nunchucks. Do I not get to use the nunchucks? Oh! Got taken down by barrels. I would have loved to get a Tommy gun. To use the Tommy gun. Is that a lance? We got an Arthur lance? They just lost the Arthur lance? So are they ninjas? Is that what it is? I didn't know I could do that. Hey, 
That damages me slightly when I do that, though. I now have the rings of power on Amazon. <laughs> Oh, it's another robot. Target confirmed. Terminate immediately. Oh, ow. It's an Uzi. Oh. Uh, let's get the Uzi. U Uzi, glad to see me. I don't think that worked very well. Uh. Oh, God, here come pretty boys. Laser burns. Oh, it kicks in the air, too. Pick up the Uzi. There we go. Ow. Oh, bring me back with another quarter. I've disarmed you. That's the same recycled jokes at this point. Five stage clear. It just said stage five cleared. So many items. They just gave us a ghoul and goblins Arthur Lance. That's crazy. Big Ben, your luck's finally run out. I made sure to stop drinking to say that. I know he's hiding somewhere in this hotel. It ends for you tonight, King Pen. I swear it. He's gonna blow up the hotel. He's... He just blew a hole right into the side of it. Clearly, we can't take him out with guns. We'll have to resort to hand-to-hand -to -hand combat. Imagine if the beat -em up was just this the entire time. Well, I guess steel's just not as hard as it used to be. Arthur Lance. Give me that Lance. Spear him. Ah, oh, he brought the Lance back to use against me. Batters up. <laughs> Flies across the screen. <laughs> Careful, I can be a little hot headed. Now oh, I got pile drived. Guns it is. Oh. 
Oh, he's got nunchucks too. I want those nunchucks, man. Oh. Wait, this. What was that guy's name? Bosco? Down the elevator shaft. I'm gonna give you the shaft. Uh, <laughs> Dynamite. Dynamite. They've always said I had an explosive personality. to the end surprisingly the dynamite wasn't strong enough to take out that uh, cable for the elevator Ooh. time to extinguish you I don't have a fire extinguisher because it doesn't make sense anymore they're just confused by all these puns A lot of money. Oh, no, it grabbed me. Yeah, yeah. We're back, baby. Say, jeez. Yeah. Sometimes crime can be piercing. Maybe I should make 90s references in some of these. What are some good early 90s references? I did not have sex with that woman. It's the best I got. You guys remember that? The Bill Clinton trials? You guys, you guys remember that? Back when precedents were cool. And played saxophones. Is that just like a little bomb goblet? Like a 
up all the rings. We're good. We're good. Nope, oh, dropping in from the ceiling. It's the king pen. Your ridiculous little vendetta ends now, Punisher. It's all over, Kingpin. You're through. We can continue from here. We don't have to just... Alright. Guess it took a little while. He just slapped me, by the way. He's slapping me. The disrespect. <laughs> oh... Hit me with that five finger discount across the face. Oh god, he's holding me. Laugh at me, will you? So is he just holding us just to laugh? Is that what the holding is? Instead of like holding me to punch me, they just stand there and laugh? Oh! <laughs> the boss slapped you. I can understand having a ring hidden inside of the couch, but uh, a hammer? A war hammer? Back to guns, huh? You got me in the air. Back for revenge. You will be punished. What was that? <laughs> Punched him right in the fat. I don't know, that wasn't a good one. We fisted him for justice. All right, I guess that's that's where we're gonna end that one. there. <laughs> so many items were used. Complete the Punisher continues, okay. Oh no, the whole building is going to blow. Damn, we've got to get out of here. Good night, fat boy. Ah, the 90s, where you could make fun of somebody's being fat. I mean, you can now. You'll get a lot more, like, dirty looks and angry tweets than you would in the 90s. As the Kingpin faced his final defeat at the Punisher's hands, the King building, his support structure badly damaged, collapsed, its dying echo reverberating through the city like an anguished roar of an exorcised demon. With his defeat of the King's building collapsed, the Kingpin Empire said, and the powerful guy, and had a store part. But for the Punisher, while the battle between the war goes on for him, no rest of one with the earth fight, in a possible test, perhaps, it is the fate of a never ending war. A war he'll never win. It is for a man, he accepted his unable fate, keep his cruel destiny. The night the Punisher vanished into the dark, many of the shadows, Suck it. Oh, didn't get to finish that. <clears throat> the next morning, the police searched through the rubble of the King building. They found over 298 ex criminals, but they could not find anybody that could be identified as the Kingpin. The Punisher team, all staff. And then we get the credits.
I vaguely remember the Punisher or the, the Kingpin battle. I actually don't know if as a kid I ever got that far in. I'm pretty sure I didn't. This game's difficult to like not have any KOs in it. We struggled for a few of those uh, boss battles, Kingpin battle especially. What was that duck? Could I have done that duck move the entire time with the explosions? Someone's name is just Go. So like when I was getting hit with missiles and stuff, I could have just ducked down and do avoided everything. Ooh, Director Poo. Ha 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 ha. Scott in all Capcom staff. Yeah, that all Capcom staff just got shafted there, huh? Good for Scott getting the one shout out of the Capcom staff. Alright, I get to put in my name. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, they didn't let me put my name in there. It just did it as cap. Reached the top of the online ranking. Curse you, censorship. Oh, it's probably because it's online and other people can see it. I was thinking it was just for me. Uh, we're, we're good. We're going to go back. Let's go to the menu. So bam, there you have it. That's the Punisher. I'm going to go through the rest of the games too, but we're going to do them certain videos at a time. How long did that take? About an hour. All right. So you're going to have an hour long video. Enjoy. I hope you all liked it. All the different uh, from, from the very long winded explanation at the beginning to the terrible puns of uh, playing the Punisher. Maybe I'll come back and do it again, play it as Nick Fury. I'm sure that's one of the achievements. So, uh, yeah. Anyways, thank you all for watching. And I'll see you in the next game of, uh, hang on. Hang on, we know this one. It is Marvel vs. Capcom Fighting Collection Arcade Classics. Goodbye.